हेलो स्टूडेंट वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू हाउ आर यू आई होप यू ऑल आर हैप्पी हेल्दी एंड फाइन एट होम डू यू रिमेंबर वट वर वी डिस्कसिंग येस्टरडे आई थिंक येस्टरडे वी वर डिस्कस अबाउट द फाइव मेम्बर्ड हेट्रोसाइकली कंपाउंड एंड फर्स्ट वन इज अ फ्यूरान एज वी नो दैट विच इज अ फाइव मेम्बर्ड रिंग एंड सिंथेसिस ऑफ फ्यूरान हाउ फ्यूरान वुड बी सिंथसाइज इन द लैबोरेटरी स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम विच स्टार्टिंग मटेरियल विच इज अ कैटालिस यूज देयर दैट काइंड ऑफ द डिस्कशन वी हैड डिस्कस इन अवर प्रीवियस लेक्चर्स द स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द स्टार्टिंग कंपाउंड इज टेकन एज अ वन टू Uh, from one four diketone and after that the acetonyl acetone on heating with p2o5 undergoes a cyclization gives टू फाइव डायमिथाइल फ्यूरान एंड दिस सिंथेसिस वॉज गिवन बाय ग्रेट साइंटिस और दिस सिंथेसिस ऑल्सो नोन एज पॉलनॉर सिंथेसिस फॉर और ऑफ फ्यूरान पॉलनॉर सिंथेसिस ऑफ फ्यूरान और यू कैन जस्ट से फ्यूरान सिंथेसिस एंड आफ्टर दैट we had discussed the reaction of furan and reaction of furan as we know that furan is a aromatic compound which fulfill or which obeys hukel's rule and therefore even though it is a five membered ring but it is a aromatic compound two are the pi bond present two and two are four pi bonds are present along with the lone pair which is present on the hetero atom oxygen atom especially in case of the furan and which would complete the sextet of that aromaticity whatever requirement is there it fulfilling that requirement and therefore furan can act as an aromatic compound it is a five membered heterocyclic aromatic compound and as we know that they undergoes as a electrophilic substitution reaction but in case of the furan at what position whether it electrophilic substitution reaction occur at two or three position and here clearly written furan undergoes electrophilic substitution reaction at two position which is underlined here which is very important one whatever the readily or commonly electrophilic substitution given by benzene such as nitration sulfonation halogenation friedel craft alkylation friedel craft acylation डायजो कपलिंग रिएक्शन दीज आर द रेडिली रिएक्शन और कॉमनली रिएक्शन गिवन बाय द अरोमेटिक कंपाउंड जनरली एज अ बेन्जीन एंड दियर फोर दीज रिया दीज कॉमनली रिएक्शन ऑल्सो गिवन बाय डेस फ्यूरान बट एट वॉट पोजिशन दैट इज अ बिग प्रॉब्लेम एंड दैट बिग प्रॉब्लेम इज just solve by giving underlying here two position why two position let us see here the resonating structures i have shown over here and why it gives the electrophilic substitution at two position that is shown over here up to that we have seen and now first reaction we are going to discuss here 
about the sulfonation let us see first reaction of furan is a sulfonation 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 that is a reaction which we are going to discuss over here and sulfonation of furan is not carried out with concentrated sulfuric acid as it opens the furan ring hence sulfonation of furan is carried out with sulfur trioxide and pyridine sulfonation of furan here remember sulfonation of furan sulfonation of furan is not carried out carried out with concentrated h2so4 sulfonic acid as it opens the furan ring as it opens the furan ring as it opens the furan ring hence furan 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 hence hence furan ring hence sulfonation of furan hence hence sulfonation of furan hence hence sulfonation hence sulfonation of furan hence sulfonation of furan is carried out is carried out with so3 sulfonic <coughs> sulfonic trioxide so3 and pyridine and pyridine so that is a very simplest reaction takes place over here sulfonation sulfonation of furan is not carried out with concentrated h2so4 as it opens the furan ring hence sulfonation of furan is carried out with sulfur trioxide and the pyridine now as we know that the structure of furan this is a structure of furan when it is treated with so3 so3 in presence of pyridine in presence of pyridine sulfonation takes place this reaction is known as a sulfonation and the reaction temperature is kept around 100 to 100 to 110 degree centigrade sulfonation as we know that the sulfonic group is introduced at two position this is a electrophilic substitution reaction the source of sulfonic acid will be the sulfur trioxide and the resulting compound obtained will be this one furan and at two position there will be this sulfonic acid group and which is known as two furan sulfonic acid is a one two position 3 4 and 5 there uh, the sulfonic group is attached at two position and therefore it is known as two furan two furan sulfonic acid to furan sulfonic acid 
to furan sulfonic acid this is uh, this is the name of this resulting product and this is known as a sulfonation reaction now let us see another reaction that is a friedel craft oscillation reaction second reaction we are going to discuss friedel craft oscillation reaction friedel craft oscillation reaction second would be friedel craft friedel craft oscillation reaction oscillation oscillation reaction friedel craft oscillation reaction friedel craft oscillation reaction furan reacts with acetyl chloride in presence of alcl3 as a catalyst gives two acetyl furan see very simple reaction friedel craft oscillation reaction furan furan reacts with reacts with acetyl acetyl chloride acetyl chloride in presence of in presence of aluminum chloride alcl3 in presence of alcl3 as a catalyst as a catalyst as a catalyst gives a two acetyl furan gives gives Two acetyl furan gives two acetyl furan gives two acetyl furan. Look at here, friedel craft oscillation. Furan reacts with acetyl chloride in presence of AlCl3 as a catalyst. Gives two acetyl furan. Let's see here. As we know that the starting compound. must be furan because we are talking about we are discussing about reaction of furan and furan undergoes electrophilic substitution reaction at two position that is very clear so here the furan which is treated with acetyl chloride as we know that ch3c double bond ocl in presence of alcl3 which is act as an lewis acid catalyst and the this reaction is known as friedel craft oscillation oscillation reaction this one and where this acetyl group which is going to attach at two position that is so clear here o then c double bond o ch3 this is known as a gives two acetyl furan here 2 1 2 3 4 and 5 at two position acetyl group is introduced and therefore this the iupsc name of this compound is two acetyl two acetyl two acetyl furan two acetyl furan which is a name of this compound two acetyl furan see here how reactions are easily carried out giving high yielded product and the next reaction which we are going to discuss about third one reaction of furan and as we know that furan undergoes electrophilic substitution reaction at two position let us move on to the next reaction next reaction means third reaction would be diazo coupling reaction diazo coupling known as a diazo diazo 
coupling diazo coupling reaction diazo coupling diazo coupling reaction here furan reacts with benzene diazonium chloride at 5 degree centigrade gives 2 phenyl azo furan 2 phenyl azo furan which is known as a diazo coupling reaction furan reacts with once again starting compound is a furan furan reacts with reacts with benzene benzene diazonium diazonium benzene diazonium chloride benzene diazonium chloride at 5 degree centigrade gives 2 phenyl 2 phenyl azo 2 phenyl azo furan 2 phenyl azo furan so that is once again is very good reaction high yielding product so let's see here look at the sentence furan react with benzene diazonium chloride at 5 degree centigrade gives 2 phenyl azo furan as we know that the starting compound should be furan which will react with benzene diazonium chloride benzene diazonium chloride c6ch5 n triple bond n cl positive charge on this and minor charge that is a di benzene diazonium salt this is a diazo coupling reaction diazo coupling reaction take place at two position and the resulting compound would be obtained as this one you can observe this reaction carefully here n double bond n then c6 h5 or you can write that is a ph never mind c numbering system 1 2 3 4 5 2 at two position this azo group is there and therefore we can call it as a 2 phenyl 2 phenyl azo furan azo furan that would be the name of this compound the next reaction which we are going to discuss that is a rimmer timon reaction so here fourth reaction which we are going to discuss which is a rimmer timon reaction let's see here reaction number fourth one which is a rimmer rimmer which is a rimmer rimmer timon rimmer timon reaction rimmer timon reaction rimmer timon reaction it is one of the very good reaction in benzene moiety or in aromatic moiety we can introduce formyl group very smoothly reaction can take place and the resulting compound obtained will be let us see here when furan is treated with chloroform and potassium hydroxide undergoes rimmer timon reaction giving two fro two furan carboxy aldehyde that is a furfural which is known as a furfural 
when when furan when furan is treated with when furan is furan is treated treated with chloroform 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 and koh potassium hydroxide undergoes 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 rimer timer undergoes rimer undergoes rimer timon rimer timon reaction rimer timon reaction giving rimer timon reaction giving two furan two furan two furan carboxy carboxy aldehyde aldehyde which is commonly known as four furan commonly known as a four furan and which is a very good reaction high yielding product always gives here you see this is a furan when it is treated with chcl3 chloroform in presence of koh potassium hydroxide this reaction is known as a rimer timon reaction rimer 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 timon reaction rimer timon reaction the speciality of rimer timon reaction chloroform and koh that is a long mechanism we are not going to show here the mechanism only just product i am showing here this is a compound which we got over here this is nothing but as a two furan carboxy aldehyde this is known as two furan two furan carboxy aldehyde carboxy carboxy aldehyde aldehyde or the common name of this compound is a four furan common name of this compound is a four furan that is a common name used over here so this is a one of the reaction which we have seen over here this is fourth reaction now the one more reaction which we are going to discuss here which is fifth reaction let us see over here fifth reaction the fifth reaction will be this one which is known as a hydrogenation hydrogenation fifth reaction will be hydrogenation furan and hydrogenation at 250 degree centigrade gives tetrahydrofuran which is used as non polar solvent in many organic reactions that is the speciality of that hydrogen furan on hydrogenation furan on hydrogenation furan on hydrogenation at 250 degree centigrade at 250 degree centigrade furan on hydrogenation at 250 degree centigrade gives tetrahydrofuran gives gives tetrahydrofuran gives tetra hydrofuran shortly known as thf thf tetrahydrofuran which is used as 
which is used as non polar solvent non polar non polar solvent which is used as a non polar solvent in many organic compound many organic many organic compound in many organic many organic reaction in many organic reactions see here hydrogenation it is one of the process where if multiple bonds are there they get converted into as a saturated so furan on hydrogenation at 250 degree centigrade gives thf means tetrahydrofuran which is used as non polar solvent in many organic reaction non polar polar and the non polar you might be knowing polar those are solvent which can there is a change in dipole moment when change in dipole moment is developed if there is a large difference in electronegativity between the two atoms and that molecule should not be the symmetrical one that type of the compound or that solvent is known as a polar solvent and non-polar solvent means they do not show the dipole moment resulting dipole moment should be zero or the electronegativity between such as the compound may be as a symmetrical one just, just now I told because in a symmetrical molecule they do not show as a dipole moment even though they containing the hetero atoms but their resulting dipole moment will be zero and such type of the solvent are generally known as non-polar solvent polar means the positive and the negative charges developed due to the electronegativity difference between the two atoms when they form as a bond and that type of the solvent generally in case of the organic solid compound and the solvent solvent they can dissolve the solute and make the solution and many organic reaction generally occurring in a solvent solvent plays an important role in carry out the organic reactions but here the furan on hydrogenation at 250 degree centigrade gives tetrahydrofuran thf which is used as non-polar solvent in many organic reaction let us see the compound starting compound which we are talking about this is a furan because we are discussing the point reaction of furan and as we know that furan undergoes electrophilic substitution reaction exclusively at two position and therefore hydrogenation will be carried out in presence of molecular hydrogen H2 and Rani nickel temperature is kept around 200 to 250 degree centigrade the compound which formed will be this one this is a this we know that is a furan and the compound which we are getting over here is a THF THF tetrahydrofuran which is a saturated one I think whatever the important reaction regarding that furan, why furan shows electrophilic substitution at two position that we have seen and in some cases we are going to discuss about the nucleophilic substitution reaction 
but that we will see later on here are the reactions of furan we have covered in our upcoming lecture we will discuss about the second five membered ring which is a pyrrole their properties the synthesis and the reaction whatever reaction we have seen five reaction commonly shown by these heterocyclic aromatic compound that we are going to discuss by taking the starting material is a pyrrol and i think with this let us stop today here remaining we will see in the next lecture thank you have a nice day